So we all know that I and probably the majority of you was holding your BTT on Voyager when it got locked up, unfortunately. But I just recently started buying BTT again on a different platform. And I'm gonna show you what platform it is in a minute, but this time I'm going to start putting my crypto, especially my BTT, in a cold storage wallet, guys. As I think everyone should hold most of their cryptocurrency on a cold storage wallet. Cause you don't want to be asked out like we were with all of our cryptocurrency that's currently locked up on Voyager guys. But nonetheless, I have recently started buying into BTT again on this new platform called Kraken. You guys probably know what it is, but I'm buying it and I'm not leaving it on there for long. I'm taking it off of there and putting it onto cold storage wallets, doing what I can. Though I haven't swapped any of it yet. I recently just started doing this. I bought a, a few dollars worth of BTT the other day and also Tron. We're gonna take a look at that in a second. And those two are the only cryptocurrencies I'm buying slash holding on the Kraken platform. We're gonna take a look at exactly how the platform looks like in a second. I just wanna go over, like if you are currently buying BTT or you don't know where to buy BTT anymore, there is places to buy. I chose Kraken because it was the most convenient for me and when it's the, it was the best choice, in my opinion, for what I needed it to do, right? I'm not going to hold things on there long term, but I will use it to send back and forth to my cold storage wallet or other platforms. So it feels good buying back into BTT because recently these between the BTT videos that I've been making, I haven't necessarily held any. I mean, I still had it on Voyager platform, but I can't get to it. So what's the point, right? But now I'm currently holding it and I can I can do things with it. So I'm excited about that. I'm excited to start making these BTT videos more regularly for you guys. Like I said, I was going to try to do one every week, but not enough news comes out every week. But I will make it maybe every week, maybe every two weeks. Whenever stuff comes out and I feel the need to make it, I'll make it for you. But let's go ahead and check out exactly what this Kraken platform looks like. Again, guys, I still have full faith in the BTTC and BTT. I personally think buying it at these prices is a steal again because BTTC and the new BTT token is fairly new. It's it's only maybe a year old or something like that, right? So taking a look at the Kraken platform, it is pretty neat. We're releasing the Kraken. Let's go ahead and see. So this is what the platform sort of looks like. It's nice. It's cool. You can see it's basically your common crypto trading platform, cryptocurrency cold wallet. So as you can see, I only hold two positions in this portfolio, one being Tron and one being BTT. Um, I wanted to try to keep them half and half, but you know, with the rise and fluctuation of prices between these two, it's going to get a little off balance, but I am putting the same amount every week into each one. So if I put $50 in one, I put $50 in the other one. If I put $200 in one, I put $200 in the other one. If I put $1 in one, I put one in the other one. You know what I mean? That's how it goes. But I think that the, the minimum deposit here is 10 bucks. So yeah. So yeah, so this is what the platform looks like and I'm holding it to, uh, again, just buy Tron and the BitTorrent token on here. Not going to hold a lot on here for long term. I'm going to hold the majority of everything on cold store cold storage wallets, guys. So, yeah, that's where I'm buying the BitTorrent token now. Again, it feels good to continually start buying it again. I'm buying it into it every week, trying to build my position back up. Hopefully, you know, Voyager will give us our crypto back, but I highly doubt that they will, guys. So I am re-upping my position and trying to get it there as quickly as possible. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think about this platform and is this a smart move for me to do? Buy it on here and send it to a cold storage wallet or send it to another platform and what would you do? And are you currently <laughs> buying a BitTorrent token again? Anyway, that's enough of that guys. Smash the thumbs up button, hit the little red subscribe button and if you wanna continue your journey with me, go ahead and click one of these videos. I'm gonna get out of here guys. Peace, love and prosperity.